Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Which is better stevia or sucralose? Sucralose won't lose its sweetness when you put it in something hot, so it's best for cooking and baking. Stevia is very sweet, and although it can be used for food, its sweetness makes it ideal to add to drinks, especially if you are craving sugar. Why you should avoid sucralose? Some studies have shown that sucralose can change your gut microbiome by lowering the number of good bacteria by half. Research done on animals shows that sucralose can also increase inflammation in the body. Over time, inflammation can lead to problems like obesity and diabetes. Why do companies use sucralose? Because of its stability, Food manufacturers can use sucralose to create a number of great-tasting new foods and beverages in categories such as canned fruit, low-calorie fruit drinks, baked goods, and sauces and syrups. What is the safest sweetener? The best and safest artificial sweeteners are erythritol, xylitol, stevia leaf extracts, neotame, and monk fruit extract, with some caveats. Erythritol. Large amounts, more than about 40 or 50 grams or 10 or 12 teaspoons, of this sugar alcohol sometimes cause nausea, but smaller amounts are fine. What is the healthiest sugar alternative? Here are 5 natural sweeteners that could be healthier alternatives to refined sugar. Stevia. Stevia is a very popular low-calorie sweetener. Erythritol. Erythritol is another low-calorie sweetener. Xylitol. Xylitol is a sugar alcohol with a sweetness similar to that of sugar. Yacon syrup. Monk fruit sweetener. Is sucralose cancerous? There's no evidence that Splenda, sucralose, causes cancer. Some research suggests it can cause inflammation, particularly in your bowel. Chronic inflammation of the bowels is a risk factor for some types of cancer. Can you gain weight from sucralose? Does sucralose make you gain or lose weight? Products that contain zero-calorie sweeteners are often marketed as being good for weight loss. However, sucralose and artificial sweeteners don't seem to have any major effects on your weight. Is sucralose better for you than sugar? Some research suggests sucralose doesn't raise blood sugar and insulin levels in healthy people. But at least one study found that in people with obesity who didn't normally eat artificial sweeteners, sucralose could raise both blood sugar and insulin levels. Which sweetener is healthiest? 5 Natural Sweeteners That Are Good For Your Health Stevia. Stevia is a very popular low-calorie sweetener. Erythritol. Erythritol is another low-calorie sweetener. Xylitol. Xylitol is a sugar alcohol with a sweetness similar to that of sugar. Yacon syrup. Yacon syrup is another unique sweetener. Monk fruit sweetener. What's the healthiest sugar substitute? Stevia, in packet, drops or plant form, is a dietitian favorite. Not only does it contain zero calories, but stevia-based sweeteners are herbal as opposed to artificial. Stevia blended with a sugar alcohol called erythritol, Truvia, works well in low-carb baked desserts, too. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark.